Hello everybody, Kinja427 here with a stupid challenge idea that I call the No Basic Attack Challenge for Heroes of Hammer Watch. Start a file just so I get no advantages from anyone. Um, we're just gonna go in and hope for the best. Now, at the low levels, you don't want to buy anything because at this point it's honestly just a waste of money. So let's just go through, get the four ore here. You have to talk to this guy first. Send up the four ore just so it's there. I mean, we're not really gonna. Ah, dang it. I've already failed the challenge. So if this happens, you must. I just will instantly do that. And then delete my character. So, yeah, I guess this shows how the game will go. <laughs> what the heck is that name? I'm keeping it. Jennifer Richter? Ah, dang it, the 4 or was saved. Eh, what, whatever. But it's mainly just to lose any EXP gain. So. The right mouse button right now is our only mean of attack. However, as you can see, it drains stamina. Or drains mana. Right now, our max mana is 75, and the only attack takes 25 mana. And it does shit damage. So we're going to be relying on literally anything else like traps and running mainly running this is just going to be like a full playthrough of the no left of the no basic attack challenge so um yeah that's there so right off the bat you'll notice that the main challenge is early game grinding because experience is going to be near impossible to come by there's just going to be long periods of waiting which I'll try to skip right now I'm just explaining everything so once we get our secondary attack here the Q1 then things will get a bit easier as we'll have another method of attack and this makes the game a bit more interesting because you have to balance dealing more damage with attacks costing more mana. Because, yeah, as you upgrade your attacks, yes, they'll deal more damage, but they'll cost more mana as well. It's a balancing act. And I, for one, think that this will add just a right extra bit of challenge to this game. So, yeah, self imposed challenge run. Let's do this. Um, yeah, I'll cut back when something interesting happens, such as me clearing this floor. Oh, shoot, one other thing, um, I'm trying to figure out how to check to show, like, that I... Hmm... There's gotta be an ability in here that shows how many times you've left-clicked attack. I don't know. Wait, what drinks do we have? No, oh, missed it on the run. Oh, cool. So yeah, I'll try to figure that out. Just take it on good faith that I'm literally just going to stand in the same spot to let my mana regen when I need to. Okay, so here we go. I've come up with an idea. It's now bound to the Windows key. So now I can press left mouse button all I want. And in fact, I'm going to rewind this over to mouse left. And there we go. Actually, reset. Ah, I I probably messed something up here. Mouse scroll down and oh, you could probably accidentally hit that. Um, F12. No, you can't. Oh, you can set it to that. Cool. There you go. So now, active skill 1, 
is set as F12. And active skill 2 is set as mouse left. I've now accepted those as the controls. And see, when I left click, it'll now do the my special attack. So yeah, just wanted to share that with you guys. See, when I finally clear this floor, this is going to take forever. So yeah, I've got to say, I'm sorry I haven't been recording much. I've just, like, not really been interested in recording lately. Like, I don't know why. It's just, it's like, eh, nah. No, it's way too early for me to be suffering from burnout. But I think I'm suffering from burnout. Like, it just doesn't interest me. So, it's not burnout, probably, but it's just, like, I just have no reason to do this anymore. On the plus side, though, I can finally see the exit. There was a lot of consumables on this floor, which is really a blessing. Because, yeah, for every three, I can now do my spell an additional one or two times. Which is great, because it has a set distance. So, any melee enemies are going to suck if I can't run away from them. I mean, really, that's what the left mouse button is usually for, dealing with close range enemies. But, I mean, it's my only attack right now. I'm not even at level 1, or level 2 rather. So, I've just gotta hope that I can somehow reach level 2. See what I mean? Mele melee sucks. Okay, an elevator. 5% tax. Sure, I'm getting out of this hell floor. Floor 1, accomplished. So yeah, I need to be taking liberal use of the portals to skip as many floors as possible. Because this is otherwise going to be... Like, when I finally get to a successful run, it's going to take hours of just waiting for monitor regen. Even at level 20. And heck no, I'm not doing New Game Plus. I mean, I haven't even beat that with, with main attacks. So, I know I ain't beating it with without them. <laughs> I mean, my record is, I think I've beaten the Wardens. Shit, have I? I honestly don't know where I've gotten to on that. Oh, right. Change the keybind. So, yeah. I'm just going... It's going to be really difficult. Um, if I die here, level up, I'll cut back. So, yeah. Say, um, luckily, the first four enemies are really easy to dodge. And the only reason I've cut back is because, well, honestly... The potion is on this floor, so there's that going for me. And right now, the early levels are all about trying to frickin' survive. That's it. As soon as I get a melee spell, all of those enemies would be dead in two seconds. But right now... Well, I died. Okay, so yeah, that's how this game's gonna go. Um, let's see here. What do I think's gonna be the best? If I had to take a guess, I would say going with. Hmm, I don't know because this totally changes everything. Like, you need to know what's going to be the most important for you. Like, and also, every single character is going to make the game a lot more different. Or, a, or really different. Because right now... Okay. Hmm. So I want to get the guild hall to tier 2 ASAP so I can unlock Frost Noble 1. And then the Orb of Winter 
is also going to be really powerful. But see, right now the spell costs thir Comet 2 costs 30, which is 5 more than it used to. So, it's all a giant balancing act. So, um, yeah, I'm just gonna go through some runs off camera, and I've got no idea how to show that I have an attack, but please, just trust me. I mean, I've rebounded to a key that I've already forgotten right now. So, I think I'm okay. Just find some bronze keys, and see you guys when I'm done with some runs. Level 2, finally! So um, yeah, if anybody is interested in trying this, I highly recommend Sorcerer just because of their powerful skills, and also because it's literally the only class that I've got experience with. Don't be an idiot like me though. See you guys when I finally, eh, it's gonna take forever for me to level up, so you know what, yeah, I'm just going to go through see how far I can get, and I'll see you guys in like, a long time from my perspective. So yeah, I, I've just been doing a few runs, and I'm still at level 2. I have figured out a strategy to survive a bit longer though, using traps. See? Works like a charm. And I can even tank a little bit. Of course, now I'm at 1 health. So, um, yeah. I just want to go and fight one of the bosses. I don't care if I win, I just want to fight the golem. <sighs> See you guys when that eventually happens. Okay, so I've been doing this for a little while, and here are my current thoughts. Do not do this challenge. Honestly, big mistake doing this. Like, seriously, it takes forever to clear out a single floor like honestly I'm just trying to figure out what the best line of is because I'm allowed to use literally anything else I just cannot use the basic attack that's the only limitation so I cannot use frost shard any level Honestly, if I didn't find that well, I'd on the first floor, I'd probably still be there. <laughs> Honestly, this challenge sucks. Do not do this. I don't care how much time you've got. This is the worst mistake of my life. Well, one of the worst mistakes of my life. And here's how much XP I've got. I'm still level 2. At the very least, I died, so... Wow. Yeah, this is going to take ages. So, I'll see you guys in about... 5 hours. When I'll hit level 5. Oh wait, I can upgrade Comet. Sweet! That double that doubles my damage. Woo! More damage! For just five extra mana. Meaning I can fire it a total of three times. I mean granted I can still fire it a total of three times in rapid succession. But before, I'd still have a decent amount of mana to fire it a fourth time. But at the very least, this deals more damage. Woo! Let's see how fast this goes. Okay, so I finally reached level 3. This is just ridiculous at this point. It's averaging like 30 minutes to clear a single floor. If you, anyone thought this challenge was still a good idea, rethink that decision. 30 minutes to clear a single floor. At, at higher levels, I could pretty much clear an, the int, like half the dungeon in that amount of time. 30 minutes, man, this is just ridiculous. M using traps to try and 
it speeds this process up. <laughs> oh my gosh, it doesn't help that I'm going for 100% clearing because I need the XP. On the plus side, level 3. Yay. Let's see, that'll help get some mana back. The bosses are going to be a nightmare to fight. Especially with only my one comet spell. On the plus side, it's level 2, so... Yeah. Okay, here we go. Personal best. Level 2. <laughs> uh, this is just going to be like an ongoing series. So, yeah. I think I'm going to end this episode here with my just pain and suffering. Worst challenge idea ever. Uh, again, never do this challenge. I don't care if you really want to. This is, without question, the worst idea I've ever had. I can't even use it to open doors faster. Wrong type of ring. One of the ones that increased health. Well, or modern recovery. Well, anyway, if you guys have enjoyed, make sure to hit that like button. Please, this video honestly took about an hour to record. <laughs> uh, um, subscribe if you're new. Leave a comment down below if you've enjoyed or if you have any tips. And, yeah. Jennifer Richter, we'll see you guys in the next video. <laughs> so can't believe that name. Bye.